Hi, this is Terry Schmidt with the Sioux Falls Convention and Visitors Bureau, and we're going to talk today about some of the things going on in Sioux Falls September 17th through the 23rd. First of all, at the Old Courthouse Museum, there are several exhibits uh, that are ongoing at the museum. One is Bicycles, Life on Two Wheels. Another is the Minnehaha County Towns exhibit, the Symbol of Freedom, the American Flag exhibit, and Vietnam in Our Own Words exhibit. The Old Courthouse Museum also has a Kids Activity Day this week. Over at the Pettigrew Home and Museum, uh, the exhibit they have in an ongoing fashion is Cabinet of Curiosities, a look at Sioux Falls' first museum, Speculation and Conflict, the Rise of Sioux Falls exhibit, and Wallace Dow Prairie Architect exhibit. You can go to cake decorating class if you want to this week. It's going to be Course 2, Flowers and Cake Design, and that is at Ace Hardware at 12th and Kiwanis. Now, the Washington Pavilion also has some exhibits that are ongoing. One is the Don Snell Art Exhibition. Another is the first juried exhibition from the Collections Immaterial Exhibit and Holding the Holy Collaborative Fiber Art by Vicki Kessler and Donna Jonas. The fall road races are going to be held, held this week, and you can go to the corner of I-229 and South Cliff Avenue for those races. Also taking place this week is Monday night open gym night at Oyate, and I'm assuming that that is the Oyate um, Community Center. Uh, also open gym at all the community centers this week. The South Dakota Robotics Elementary Engineers classes will be taking place this week, and that's at 4103 South Southeastern Avenue. The walking clubs are going to be walking this week, and that's at Kenny Anderson and Morningside Community Centers. You can go to beginning swing lessons, and they're going to be held at First Christian Church in Sioux Falls. Club David is going to have karaoke this week. Uh, the kids' cross-country meets uh, are taking place this week at 2400 South Bonson Avenue. And at the zoo, you can go and le leap like a lemur, and that's a zoo cub class, and also a class of yellow giraffes this week at the zoo. Uh, the Siouxland Public Library at the Cayley Branch is going to hold a session called Medicare Informational Session this week. You can go to Legacy Parks for Moms and Tots Tuesday. The Museum of Visual Materials is going to hold an open drawing group. They're also going to have a cooking class called Vegan Delights and another cooking class called Co-op Cooking with Chef Abby Gluten-Free. Then you can go to Weekday Morning Play Group at Keene Park and at Morningside Park both this week. The Color Club for Quilting is going to meet at the Sioux Falls Quilters headquarters and Lego Build It is going to uh, hold their class at 4103 South Southeastern. There's going to be a tribute to Elvis this week in Sioux Falls and that's at 315 North Phillips Avenue. The Home Buyer Express Part 2 class will be held at the main library in downtown Sioux Falls. Sodak Toastmasters are going to meet at the Calvary Episcopal Cathedral. The South Dakota Robotics will meet also in a Duplo, D-U-P-L-O, all caps, Dynamos class this week. Sylvia's Bridal Quilt Sampler Club will meet at Dolly Farm Village this week. You can also go to the 2012 South Dakota Convoy Truck and Car Show in Sioux Falls uh, this week. You can dance at the dance ballroom and studio. They're going to have third Friday dances and lessons. And also at the dance ballroom and studio this week is going to be the seventh annual ballroom dance week free lessons at dance. JNL Harley Davidson is holding their bike night at JNL this week. You can go to Date Night Dance Company Open Dance and that's out on South Louise Avenue. And the Heartland Country Corn Maze will be open and um, expecting visitors this week. Now, the Wachipi Water of Life celebration is also going to be held in Sioux Falls this week. Uh, the Knights of Columbus Hall is going to play host to the National Ballroom Dance Week of 2012. And the South Dakota Robotics class is going to hold another class called, all capital letters, NXT, 
robotics classes. You can march into the light in downtown at the Riverfront Amphitheater at Sharapa Place this week. You can go to a class at Shield Sports, and the class is called Concealed Carry Weapons Class. JNL Harley Davidson is also hosting their fall open house and demo days. And a uh, long awaited annual event in Sioux Falls is the Fall Parade of Homes, and that kicks off this week. Also, we, had, we talked about the dance lessons at the dance ballroom and studio. Along with that, there's going to be sword dancing in the park at 3500 South Cliff Avenue in Sioux Falls. And Word Fest will be held at 200 North Dakota Avenue in Sioux Falls this week. We also have continuation of sculpture walk throughout the city, but mainly downtown Sioux Falls. The Wells Fargo Cynodome is continuing to offer movies. The Falls Park Farmers Market will be uh, available Saturdays through October 27th. And the Sioux Falls Corn Maze is available at Yogi Bear Jelly Jellystone Park, and that's weekends through October 27th. Eros Data Center is also offering their tours again. They were off for a few weeks doing some construction, but they're back and available. There are guided tours at Eros Monday through Friday at 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. and self-guided tours from 8 to 4 on Monday through Friday. And the Falls Park Visitor Center continues to be open. Um, there is a lot of information on Sioux Falls if you're looking for information or Sioux Falls memorabilia. This is Terry Schmidt for Town Square Media.